The following operator training video on the Hobart Model 6115 potato peeler is a supplement to the instruction manual that came with your potato peeler. If you have any questions concerning operation, please consult your manual. Your Hobart Model 6115 potato peeler is constructed and designed to give long, satisfactory service, providing it is properly used and maintained. This training video will cover the operation, cleaning, and maintenance of the Model 6115 potato peeler. The 6115 potato peeler is designed to peel 15 to 20 pounds of product in one to three minutes using a one-third horsepower motor. Where applicable, fit the rubber fill hose connector over any cold freshwater tap. Close and latch the discharge chute door. Note, the discharge chute door must always be left open when the unit is not in use. Position the hopper top in place on the peeler housing. Pour the product into the hopper. There should be room in the hopper for the product to move around while peeling, so do not overload the peeler. The capacity, remember, is 15 to 20 pounds maximum. Turn on the water supply. Turn on the peeler. Peeling time will vary depending on the type and condition of the product. When the desired degree of peeling has been reached, turn off the water. Place a container under the discharge chute to catch the product and open the discharge chute door. After the product has been completely discharged, turn off the peeler and it's ready for a repeat operation. If the peeler is equipped with a peel trap or basket, it will be necessary to empty the peel trap drawer or basket occasionally. Warning, unplug the machine power cord before beginning any maintenance or cleaning procedure. The peeler should be cleaned after the peeling operation has been completed. As soon as the peeling operation has been completed and before the hopper has had time to dry, Turn on the water and flush the interior of the hopper. Then turn off the water. Remove the hopper top and clean it in a sink. Turn on the water again and thoroughly clean the interior of the hopper using a mild soap and a brush and rinse thoroughly. Clean the housing beneath the abrasive disc with mild soap and water and rinse thoroughly. Note, if the abrasive disc should stick, and isn't easily removed, it may be loosened by removing the hex head screw on top of the hop and threading a longer screw, such as a 5 16 inch, 18 by 1 and a half inch in until the disc loosens. If the peeler is equipped with a peel trap, remove the peel trap drawer and thoroughly clean the drawer, as well as the peel trap interior. The discharge chute must be left open when the unit isn't in operation in order to prolong the life of the door seal. Warning, unplug the machine power cord before beginning any maintenance or cleaning procedure. This machine is equipped with a manual reset overload protection switch. If during operation, the motor should overheat and trip this switch, Turn the peeler switch off and allow the motor to cool for several minutes. To reset the switch, remove the bottom screw from the cover plate, rotate the cover plate, and push the red button. If the overload protection switch persists in tripping, contact your local Hobart service office. This concludes operator training for the Hobart Model 6115 potato peeler. To obtain service and parts information, Concerning the 6115, contact your local Hobart Service Office.